with the pound dollar and look at this how magnificent this is we had this big push to the upside it came back and it closed at 162.98 right and what is our structural point 162.97 so this actually is quite a bearish setup for the British pound because it broke above the structure point there was no follow through it turned around and it closed right at the structure point so my selling point is a no brainer I am one tick away from my sell signal and if you look at the intraday chart there is your 162.77 and we're right there so technically I'm one tick away from my sell signal so it's a no brainer kind of a trade now for the short side if you will so it's going to take a second from us to plan come on to plan the pound dollar so we're going to go short the pound dollar 162.97 and our structure short is 162.973 and this is our short point and it is also when I have a short point is a structure point it is one and the same so my stop is one uh, so that's it we're, we're done with the short side now what we need to go is to find the trade to buy the long side so yes the trend is up it is magnificent to the upside but for some reason it is sitting right at the structure point so therefore I want to make sure that this thing flies so I'm going to take it right above the high of the day and that is 163.37 so my buying point is 163.37 and if I buy it at 163.37 unfortunately there's nothing here that I, I, I need to put my stop right below the structure point which is 162.97 so that is going to be my long stop and my short stop is one and the same so it's going to be really a make it or break it the, the 162.97 and my structure long now this is the one that's going to change if you see here on your daily chart which is the 164 11 that's going to be our next structural point 164 11 that is this is again when you, you when something sets up like this it, it becomes a, a brilliant no-brainer and therefore it took us only three minutes to actually plan the dollar uh, trade the pound dollar so we're buying above 163.37 our structure long is the 164 so we have about 70 pips on that trade so your risk reward is not particularly that brilliant on this trade and you can see uh, Rafael now you buy 37 your structure is 64 so you got 60 pips and your stop is 30 pips so you have 2 to 1 ratio on that trade your risk reward is 2 to 1 it's not that best of a trade but hey you, you need to take you understand uh, on the short side you have the 162.97 is the same as the structure short and it is the same as our stop okay that is the pound dollar